don't blink, it's your blink. Welcome to welcome to the show. The thing we're together having a wonderful um, 18th October 2024. We're at McDonald's right now at a very historic location for your boy Inc. Um, this is very place that's meant a lot to me. Um, it is the 18th of October. So we're going to be trying the uh, Mac Chicken, um, the Mac Crispy, and the Mac Chicken in itself. So here's the meal for your boy. We got a Reese's uh, Mac Flurry, a Reese's Chippets. We got a uh, delicious burger. We did take a bite because we did try it on camera, of course. And we did take a bite here because we tasted on camera. Now you can see there's two bites. I guess that was better. And we got a, a uh, poutine. Poutine meal because I'm Canadian and I have to somehow represent. So without further ado, let's start. The reason why we're doing this today, I was supposed to do this exact video yesterday. Um, but today, GST was tasting it and I was like, dude, you know what? If you guys taste it today, I'm going to taste it today. It seemed like a cool thing to do. And that's it. Kind of like a nice meal. Um, the whole thing was 40 bucks. A bit more expensive than meals, so. But hey, economy, right? Inflation. Inflation, right? So. This is really good. I usually don't go for chicken product at McDonald's. I usually go for um, a quarter pounder. Mmm. I have a plan for a video today. I had a plan for. Oops. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna have Kleenex. So good though. Mm. You see, I had a plan video already. Plain content. And uh. I'm sure you know that. I'm gonna tell you how important this place is to me and I have a super important place, place because without even knowing it like I grew up here I I only have a I'm sorry okay sorry man good luck so the, the reason why this place is so important to me is because I I so the store here, you see the, the decoration, right? It's different. Um, I see the difference here. And it's 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 weird because they changed this place three times. But the actual McDonald's, the actual location, exists since I was very, very young. I remember going to parties, to kid parties. I was a kid too, don't worry. Um, it's, it's weird because every single party was happening there. Every single party was happening in this precise location. It was like this spot to have kids party, I guess. And um, they changed the place. Well, I remember it, it's such a cool place because my father, I was a gamer as a kid. I was a gamer, right? My father was like, go outside, go play outside. So what I would do, and it was crazy, I had a, um, I had a, um, I think it was like twelve dollars. Don't ask me why. There's a, there's a very good reason why I was getting twelve dollars a week. Cause the um the, the they would say they would say hey um the the meal every day at cafeteria is three dollars. So I'll give you a, a four meal. I'll give you enough for four meals. And once a week you have to eat something from home. Like okay. Oh. The great thing is, I was, I had food at home, so I didn't even really need to get that cafeteria food. I would do, I would do the summer with McDonald's. And every day, I would have a milkshake, or a, um, my favorite, by the way, they changed the thing, huh? So, they would, they would, it would cost me like like 230, 240 something every single day. And I would go for mm, two days a week, every single weekend. 
I was supposed to go outside to play. Then again, I was coming inside and I was playing, um, because they had video games then. And it was, uh, I would play for three, four hours. I would come back home. And my father would say, I mean, like, I thought that. I'm like, I guess so. But I would come here every single day. Not every single day, but very often. Even as, a, as an older adult. Mm. So, I need to shut the fine. So, I would come here. I used to come to this place. Not that old, but maybe five, six years. Now, what I would do, I was embarrassed about not having Wi Fi. I would go to the library that you, that you guys saw, not too far from here. You guys know a uh, machine, right? I would go to the library and I would download things. Now, if you guys remember, I told you the library changed, uh, they renovated, um, I think it was four or five years ago. I would come here and before going to work. So before I go to work, I would have, uh, I would come here. I would download podcasts. I would download everything that I need to download. Download movies, shows. And yeah, the Wi-Fi was probably one of the best in the machines. I would come often. Um, good because now, you just have to, you just told the guy, you can stay here. Mm. The order, the rules change, but this place was a <coughs> almost a sanctuary, you know. Play games, download stuff, cheap, good food, and the funny thing is, my father lived in the higher 40 of uh, street. This is on the 32 second street. It would take me. It would take me um, 15 minutes to come here on foot from my apartment to here. 12, 10, 12 minutes. And if you look at it, I'll show you after. But basically, mm, basically, pudding is good, but it's just a lot. Mm. Yeah. It's weird because the machine to me it's weird. For other people maybe it's not weird. Every single city, right? That's the main street. The main street is usually a place where there's a lot of there's a lot of store. And if that's other people around, you say yeah. And it's Notre Dame Street. Notre Dame Street, and I can see why. Notre Dame Street, there's 40. There's like 40 store, right? However, mm, good though. Two burger, one poutine. So, when you look here, McDonald's groceries. So, yeah, there's less store, but there's more um, quote unquote important store. You, as a kid, if, as long as I was here, it didn't matter. Even now, I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I'm gonna be right next to it. Because I told you guys that, uh, the video. So, I remember that I ate yesterday. I spent the whole night on the throne. So, sadly. Um, did it was a special moon too? Was the Anthem moon, I believe? And. It was nice. So yeah, so couldn't film that. I, w I was able to take some pictures, but I filmed it a little bit, which was a godsend because otherwise I'm, I'm fucked. Well, not a big of a deal, but it was, it's once a month. 
when we started filming Nature Court about um, a year ago. And I learned about Hunter's Moon about four or five months ago. Plus, my mom, she sent me a, uh, she sent me a text to tell me, hey, is there Hunter Moon? And she said to me, like, um, I think it was Thursday, possibly Monday, Tuesday. And I was like, oh, thank you so much, mom, you know, because she, she cares. And if I don't film it, because she's watching the content. Oh, so much she won't send me a uh, text saying, hey, it's coming soon. She does the thing with parents, she does the thing with people. If they give you information, they say thank you. But you do the same mistakes, or you, you, you don't take care of this, uh, that um, information. You're gonna say, there's no use in telling that guy. My mom, I can, I can film seven, eight times precise thing that she sent. And it doesn't matter. I miss one time and she's like, you don't listen to me. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so yeah, so this place has a lot of meaning for me. You know? I remember in grade 11, we were going to the, um, to work out a lot. Every single, um, I physical dance in school. And, um, We we'll go to subway after. A little bit better, a bit healthier, and um, I would go to subway, and I wouldn't like subway. But it was the weekend. I would come here to eat. And the funniest thing. The funniest thing. Crazy, dude. So many memories here. It's nuts. So, <laughs> and a kid. I was go. I was gonna go with um, two, junior. Which is big thing: cheeseburger, um, ketchup, and mustard, right? Oh, it used to be. And um, then. As an adult, I'm like, now this is a kid meal. I want something bigger. I went for Big Mac. And Big Mac was good. Not my favorite, but it was good. It was cheap. It was good. I think back then it was like $4. For a thick ass burger. And um, I have to watch my language. There's kids around. And. I don't remember who. I came here with a friend. Mm. And it was so good. Ooh. I'm folded. I'm full. I'm not wasteful. So there's high stream and still have this. High stream can wait. This can't wait. Because it's going to be cold. It's going to be good. One friend came in. And um, you have a uh, quarter pounder. And I was like, bruh, what is that? Right? Then he showed me, and I was kind of curious. So the next time we went to McDonald's, of course, I, had, I ordered a quarter pounder, right? And uh, it was delicious. And then since that day, all I do is, uh, all I do is win no matter what, is double quarter pounder with cheese. And I don't know why I say with cheese, because it's always with cheese. And I say, oh, and the habit. And this, I didn't, I wasn't going to talk about it, because like I said, when I came in today, I only had a plan for a video. I, I had a plan for, of course, I, oh, I try not to have too many plans, but I always have plans. Um, so I came in, and... Uh, I had the plan, and then I was like, you know what? Tell about talk about how important this McDonald's is. This McDonald's was my very very first job. Um, I got hired by the asset manager. 
she were nice. You're helping people. You know. You you know the you know the menu because they come here often. They knew me, you know. And <laughs> so what happened was started working. The first shift, crazy. I don't perform well. I make a, I make two messes. I think um, I took a bag of fries, a whole bag of fries. But back then, what they would do is they would have frozen fries in the bag in the fryer. So what to do is I dropped it, and then the second time is I don't remember. I think it was the water. Um, you know what the soda are? There's something to catch the water. Then I dropped that. That was a huge mess. Then they tell me, <coughs> they said, listen, doesn't matter. This is your first shift. You know, not a big deal. And then the second, the second day, nice enough to put me in a shift that was less people. I was working four o'clock the the week weeks day. And then they placed me at ten o'clock. Second boss, mm -hmm. not stricter. Now I'm an adult and I understand that he was trying to help because I was very, very undecisive. Very, very undecisive. I would always say yes, yes, yes. And um, I was, I was, I think I was at the fire station. It's been, been, guys, it's been. 13 years, I don't remember. It was a food station. And then the boss, the boss told me, the boss told me, hey, and he tried me, he, he tried me a couple times. Trying to get me to say no, trying to get me to say yes, I don't know. And then, um, what happened was, I told me go clean the table, so that was I was working with food. And I went, then he said, "Hey, who's taking care of the fries?" And he asked me, and I was like, "I don't know." And that's that's your problem. You don't know. That's your problem. So then the next day I got a. It's such a. I know what the shop is like. That really hurt my feeling. I got fired. I thought he said that that really hurt my feeling more than the other thing. So the owner comes to me and said, listen, we tried to go on the night shift, it didn't work. We tried to go on the day shift, it didn't work. You've been here for three days and you've already been switched shift two times. It's not gonna work out. Like, okay, I understand. But my first job is fine. And then he said, I hope we don't lose you as a customer. And I was like, dude, are you serious? And I was like, that's why you hired me. That's why that's all my worth. And yeah. Mm. I'm full. This is this delicious, but I'm full. You have a nice here. I'm gonna be waiting a little bit. I'm just chilling a little bit. The boy is full. So yeah, so um, I want to come here to try the new mac chicken we did. Um, this is good though. This is really good. When I have to go back home, what I think I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do is uh, I was supposed to go shopping. I can't wait. I can't wait. Uh, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go back home. I'm gonna eat this on the balcony. Um, not because I'm uncle. Because, see, it's there's a lot of noise, a lot of songs. I'm gonna be bothering people, you know. I swear to white three times already. And there's kids around, you know. I'm full. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish this. 
Okay. It's weird because. <laughs> they changed a lot of things. Mm. Peanut butter is nice. I don't know. Oh, okay. Are you supposed to do that? I don't know. I can. I don't remember. I actually don't remember being in a place that meant more to me than this place does. Nobody did. They changed it. At the very beginning, at the very beginning, it was really, really, really weird. You had a very small like dinner table, and this is. Before, in my mind, I love this place. In my mind, McDonald's is so are so smart. What they do is look at the look at the how many. This is insane. And last piece of cheese. Last piece of cheese. Kind of cool because McDonald's they, they spend so much money, but so much money. I'm trying to do <coughs> Savage Kid as their own, as their customer. So they would do, they would do like nothing. Sorry, cartoon, yeah, cartoon. They would really push forward the idea of the kids are important. <coughs> and at first, and it's so smart. But at first, you're like, okay, this is weird. Why are they doing that? Why are they so intent on kids? Well, you realize that because the kids want to go there. Like, as a kid, how many times did I say, oh, I want to want to go to McDonald's, I want to go to McDonald's, I want to go to McDonald's, right? And then, um, you know, it's insane. As an adult, you grow up, and you remember so many good moments uh, at McDonald's. So what you do is you go back to McDonald's. Now, you know what's insane? I just realized what is this. So basically this is, you put your things on it, and there's a code, and then they'll say, okay, well, table 13 to have this. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm full. I'm seeing the sun uh, go down. Um, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go back home, and uh, I think I'm gonna I try to film the, uh, it doesn't matter if I film the nature corn tonight, because yesterday was crazy. Yes, it was crazy. Um, we have this. I can go on a on a cup. I had decided I can go on a cup. So I'm not gonna be able to film. Yeah, I think that's what, I think was, that's what I'm gonna do. And it's good. We had a, a amazing meal. We had a a cool time. Um, get the point. The point then, because I wanted to get the uh, the um, chicken Big Mac, right? I don't think I got it. However. Yeah, you guys saw it when we went today to order. <coughs> we went to the order, and we didn't have the the new chicken product. So I was like, okay. So when I end the stream here, and I'll be back when I'm home. 